Hi everybody, it's Carrie. Hello, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, welcome back. If you've been here before. Today, guys, we're going to be doing a, a Curio Cabinets and China Closet. China Closet and Curio Cabinets tour. Now, guys, before you guys, question, I know it's, I got the Christmas decorations there and some stuff to do for my cleaning up series, some of my dolls for more cleaning up series that I have to do. And over here, I have some my Halloween costumes. <laughs> I know, guys. Harry Potter robe Halloween costume, which is, I believe, a Viking. We're getting that later. So, you guys, still on top. Oh, by the way, guys, this is my good curio cap. This is my dad's good curio cabin that goes um, that belongs to my good buffet and my good dining table. But if you guys watch my house tour video and that video was horrible guys um we don't keep ours up because look that is our light and yes guys my dad took our wallpaper down and we never put it back up because guys this house was under construction most of my life this house was under construction what do you guys it's gonna be okay if you guys notice here this is my father's it has now this stuff i believe some of this is his and some of this is my grandmother's. So, like, here this is... Oh, this is my grandmom's. Those dishes and plates and stuff, they're my grandmom's. That's my grandmom's. That's probably dad's. Guys, it's getting to the point in this house. I don't know what was dad and what was Grace. So, guys, that's just a jewelry box here. Now, guys, that they're actually sets. This came from our original other house. My father's house with his first wife. Pop, guys, who is that? Now it's just my basement door. I have it cracked open because I was washing dolls all day. And that is actually our light fixture. It belongs up there. Some flowers. My grandmom loved flowers. And some other stuff. This is just, I like this coloring. I think this is mahogany, but I'm not really sure about colors. Guys, I mean, this still look guys, it's a little clear. I really don't know too, too much about the stuff that's in here. Just because of the fact that the stuff was really just on. Guys, I just thought of something. I don't know where my Princess Diana plates is. Oh, maybe they're in here. Guys, there's also stuff down there for storage. We have, I think, my trucks in there, my hash trucks. I think, guys. I don't know. You guys can see, we actually, our set is trimmed in silver. Fake, like, silver coloring. My grandmom's trimmed in gold coloring. Guys, I actually have the flash one. That's why my, I see a shadow. I'm sorry. So, guys, in a few minutes, we're going to, we're about a minute or so. We're going to go out and see my dad's curio cabinet, but I want to show So guys, just to let you guys know, three generations, my father, I, and my nephew, at one point, my, my grandmother, my father, my me, and my brother, and my nephew have called this house home. So there's five generations of stuff in this house, guys. That is why we have so much stuff. Guys, when this pulls out over four minutes, I'm going to pause and bring you guys out to the curio cabinets. Guys, this is my father's curio... This is my father's curio cabinet. Um... This stuff in here, let's see, some of this stuff, I know what it is, some I do not. I think, let's start at the bottom. Nothing with some of my dad will tell you what this stuff is. I know there's models in here my brother made, but I don't know which ones and some stuff there. The next one up, guys, zoom in. These are my grandmothers, I believe. These are all my grandmas. That is my father or uncle's. Stuff from the army, so I really don't want to show that too too much. Not to brag, guys, but my father does have excellent shooting record from the army. My father did serve. He had excellent shooting 
My brother also served one of my brothers, whose picture you will see at the third rank up, the third tower. He, I believe, was also an excellent shooter. My uncle was okay shooter, like a good shooter, they called it. We were done with firearms and stuff. I'm sorry, guys, my voice is starting to sound funny. Guys, you see that little <laughs> Santa Claus pin? That was my grandmother's, I believe, but that's mine. That some oh guys that might be from Japan. I don't know if I told you guys this, but my uncle Ralph did, did serve over in Japan his time in the army. So guys, that is my biological brother and sister. Please excuse them. Hmm. That is my that one. There's there's two jewelry boxes in here. That one's mine from my thrift store. The one in the front, the white one. I love it. Bought it for like two bucks. I keep rings there. Don't keep rings right now. I have any good jewelry, guys. I'm bad. The one in the back is very sentimental to me because our old neighbor, Marge, in our old neighborhood, gave it. Guys, is my hand in the way? I'm sorry. Gave it to my mother. Her family did. Because my mother helped these two older ladies out named Marge and Carol back when me and my brother were little. They died when I was a little girl. When I was a little girl. And the family, my mother was really good to them, people, to them ladies, so their families became like our family. And when Marge passed away, my mom had called for ambulance because she was an older woman. And she said, Shelly, my mother's name, you need to come over here and hug me. I'm going home to God. And she went, no, no, no. She said, I'm not making it, Shell. Come over here. Say, I'll come over here. Say goodbye. And when my mother hugged her, she passed away in my mother's arms. Yeah, guys, this is kind of a sad event. My mother has had several people die in her arms. I wonder if she was where she was with death and stuff. My grandma also died in my mother's arms, I believe. Because when we visited my grandma, um, we realized that she had died right at the we had left. So I think she died hugging my mother. That's kind of sad. Guys, these are my grandma's fingers, except see that girl in the back. Because I'm sorry if it's hard to see because the flash is on, but this room is really dull. As you guys can see, we do not have lights in this room. Yes, because that's my lamp there. We have um, a sheet over Daddy's chair. Guys, if you guys see this stuff back there, that's my dolls and stuff I'm actually repairing for a cleaning up series. So just excuse, I know I have miles of toys everywhere. It's starting to look like KB toys around here. <laughs> so guys, up here in the last tower. Also guys, these are all, now these are all my grandmas, except you see those German, you may have see because the flashes on those German soldiers. My dad and biological brother actually painted those. There is a certificate back there. But I am not going to zoom in on that too much because I don't know what that is. That might be something with my grandma's name on it. I don't know. Now this guy right here, the cross. Um, you guys know something really bad happened a few years ago. And he gave me hope that there was still purity and love in the world. So my grandma's, um, like I said, this is my father's. Guys, that's my girl there. That's my from Holy Communion or Baptismal. One of the I don't know. That's my old dog, Max. Or, I had a question for you guys. Oh my god, guys, that's my curio cabinet in the picture, looks like, with it. Yes, guys, that's my curio cabinet that's over there in the picture. And that cat, I don't know, that is not Misty and Molly. We had Misty and Molly at the same time we had Buddy, who were my cats. So, guys, that is, like, my love right there. That was my dog, Buddy. He was, like, the love of, like, my life. I loved my dog, guys. I was his human mom. He was my dog's son. Like, he was my most prized thing in this whole world. He passed away across at Rainbow Bridge 12 years ago this October, right before my mom did... Guys, see below that, there is a statue from a birthday cake, from a wedding cake. Guys, my voice is giving out, so please excuse that. That is from my father and his first wife, too much, who actually passed away. You guys move up here. You see, this is all my grandma's, but that one. You see that angel statue? That is mine. 
I bought that in the store because it reminded me of something I thought my grandma would want me to have. If you guys do not know, my grandma passed away when I was six years old. My other grandmom, who I heard his house from, died before I was born. Guys, this is a little like statues and stuff my dad models that my dad had painted with my biological brother before I was born. Hold on, guys. If you guys do not know that, yes, I have an older brother and sister who don't really speak to us. Now, guys, you guys go across this way, guys. This is my couch here. Show you guys. Sorry, guys. And I don't want to drop the phone, guys. I can't risk it. I don't want to drop the phone. I can't go back to Corey. Corey, I broke my phone. Like, yeah, I guess you did. Guys, that's my Bible. This is my couch. That is my motor scooter, Samantha, from Childhood Scooter, and my G.I. Joe, my dad just found from Childhood. They'll be proud of being a cleaning up series. These are my... Bunnies I made my mom when I was a little girl. This is a box from my American Girl dolls. And these are my the bunnies and ducky I made my mom when I was a little girl. Now this, guys, is a more sentimental to me curio cabinet. Because I actually had to move my grandmom's rocking chair out. Guys, we have stuff over here just because it's kind of cluttered a little bit. This is my kid I got from high school from my old buddy. This is my Charlie doll. I've seen him before. This is Wizard and a PETA doll and my... Playing bill bar, my playing bill cars. I had to move my grandmom's rocking chair out of the way to get to my. This is my. This was my mother's, guys. This was my mother's. Um. Guys. Guys, I'm gonna film with my right hand, which is not so sturdy, just so you don't keep getting my hand in the way. So guys, this is my mother's couple my mother's number Rockwells. Guys, I'm actually gonna hold it this way because I have to point. So you guys, you guys see this boy and this this older man here fishing, boy and man fishing? That's a Norman Rockwell is supposed to represent my father and brother. My other brother, you guys know I have two brothers, so the biological brother, not biological, not biological, biological, something like that. So, Derek and Dad, and I don't give out my brother's real name for privacy reasons. That is my teddy bear that a neighbor gave me who was very kind to me. Guys, I'm pointing this way. The teddy bear, the one a neighbor gave me who was very kind to me and who knew about my disability and said that she just, she loved me and thought I was a great person. Now, guys, this Norman Rockwell right here. The man, the woman, the older man with the younger woman with the baby. That is probably the most precious one in here. Guys, see that hit the pop. Because this actually represents my family more. <laughs> you guys know, I was born to older parents, almost exactly like that. An older woman with a younger man, an older man with a younger woman. My parents were almost 22 years apart in age. My father, like I said, is still here, not tempting fate. My mother hasn't been here for a long time. So, yes, guys, um, again, the show Modern Family, how Jay and Gloria, that's like literally how my parents are, were, were. And it shows them with the baby girl. Well, not with the baby girl. Um, except when I was born, I would have been smaller than that because I was three months premature and I had tubes and all. Moving over, that girl there, I have a love-hate relationship with that one. Probably because that one is mine from childhood. That my sad was coming in. I thought she looked so pretty. Why should I even have her? I was gonna get rid of her a couple of times. I thought, no, 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 no. My mom would want me to keep her, so I did. The bear next, and I believe that you still on top of my jewelry box. You have little glass bears. Bad idea, guys. Bad idea because they can break. Next, guys, that's my bear. She was on top of my jewelry box, and I love her. She's super duper cute. She's really, really pretty. Next, that one's Derek's opposite of this of mine that's Derek's he actually asked him to be an altar boy but he couldn't he didn't do it my brother's not very religious he wasn't a religious person then but he is now so guys one of the stuff is still in a box that is my angel there um I bought her I love her she, that's my mother's room in Rockwell but man the boy fishing because dad and me and Derek 
He used to go fishing back in the day before my mother's MS got paid. That is a woman with a young boy with bears on the side because my brother was born before me. So at one point, my brother was sort of an only child because he was born first and my other brother and sister were not in the picture. Excuse me, guys, I just bumped my grandmother's rocking chair. So bring it down here. Guys, this is all my mother's stuff except for the little... Elf in the basket in the coach, that's mine. I need her Julie. I had her since I was like five. The other stuff, I really can't tell you anything about. To be honest, I mean. Now, the shelf before last. See the, um, the characters there? That is my grandmom's. I know for a fact that's not mine. That I'm not sure. That is my statue, the Philly guy. Okay, no, I live in Philadelphia School. That teddy bear in the front, that's mine. And guys, all the way down there at the bottom, the man and the woman, that was on my parents' wedding cake. That is my parents. Um, from my father and mother's wedding cake, as I said before, my father was married twice. That is from his second marriage from my mother. And that is my grandfather's matchbooks from my grandfather's Luncheonette. My grandfather ran his own shop, guys. His own luncheonette. So, guys, we're going to pause on a few more knickknacks in the kitchen. Guys, I apologize. I did not turn the big light on when I was filming. I ended up in this room. So, guys, this is some of my grandmom's, like, plates and stuff. They're really old. Grandma actually got to take them down and clean them. I know they're painted black, guys, but I should have said that in the beginning. They're my grandmom's salt and pepper shakers, like, hugging. I don't even know. They may not be salt and pepper. This is a little guy, a little Italian guy there. So, the guys, you know, I'm pointing there. Same thing. That's my grandmom, actually. That's my grandmom as a young woman. And these are not so truly acceptable to have today. But back in my grandma's time, they were cute. One's a salt shaker and one's a pepper shaker. So, guys, this video is getting much, much too long. And so, my, might be my dad's rooster and stuff. You guys see me have stuff here, too. So, like I said, guys, four generations have called this house home. And five generations of stuff is in this house. So, we have a ton of stuff. If you guys like this kind of content, comment, like, share, subscribe, and tell me down below. If you guys have any knickknacks, you guys have anything from your grandparents and stuff like that. To me next up, a little video. Remember, Carrie loves you all. Goodbye, guys. That's just how I store my pots and pans.